sorry for the weird lighting, um, but today I'm going to show you how to make a tail bag. I made one of these videos before, but it wasn't as, um, it wasn't as good as I thought it would be. So what you'll need is a, a needle, some thread that matches your fabric, and some scissors. Okay, so first I started out with a piece of fabric that was a whole rectangle thingy. Okay, so. Yeah. Started out, let's just say those aren't there. It started out like this. And now, you're going to fold it in half. Like that. Because you sew things inside out. So you get a seam the right way. Okay, so I bring it over here. Now, what I did was I cut two slits there. One, da, da. And then I just cut that. So that's what you're going to want. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sew the outside in the bottom. Then I'm going to come back and show you what it looks like. Okay, guys. So I just finished stitching the um, outside in the bottom and you leave that part open for the horse's tail and I'm just gonna do a quick um, restitching I'm just gonna double stitch it whatever you call that because panda is a little crazy sometimes so I'm just gonna do that again to make sure it doesn't break cuz yeah Alright, so you can skip this next step that I'm doing, but I'm just going to restitch it again. Okay, so I just finished um, sewing the sides and the bottom. So now I'm going to turn it inside out. Just give me... Okay, so here it is. Here's the seams. They're kind of bad, but I'm not a perfect sewer, so. That is what it looks like. And then what you should do is you braid your horse's tail, um, like a few inches past the tailbone, and then you stick that in there, and then you separate the braid, and then you just tie that. Alright, so that is my thingy, my doodle. My tail bag. Have any questions, just ask me, and you can use any fabric that you think will hold up. This is like a cotton... Um, yeah, so... That is my tail bag.